everyone welcome back i hope you watched the first video of my thailand series which was about the maya bay tour i give like a lot of information there in like five or six minutes so definitely watch that video first and then come here and watch this it's going to be about the james bond island tour compared to the two i think i preferred this one more for like two main reasons the first one is that it is really near the port most of the places were like really near to each other and also there's like a canoe activity here included in this trip which was like the highlight of my Phuket trip i'm not gonna lie it was so beautiful it was so fun compared to the two i would definitely say that was like more premium than this one but the buffet lunch included in this trip was definitely better like way better than the maya bay trip so this day was gonna get super hectic because at night we had booked the monday night muay thai thai boxing event i love watching ufc mma so it was really fun watching muay thai i hope you enjoy the vlog and see you at the end Voice over Zonchi is back, so because I was scared of seasickness, I usually don't eat my breakfast and pack them with me to eat later. Here we go off to the port. I don't know how many people were on the boat, but we grabbed the front seat real quick. It was a very quick journey to our first stop, which was the James Bond Island. There is literally nothing to do here except take pictures and buy some pearl jewelry. And the James Bond movie Golden Gun was shot here in 1974, hence the name James Bond Island. Then we move on to the next stop which was the Fisherman Village. This one was slightly underdeveloped than Patong for sure and was very secluded but it was also full of pearl jewelry. As our boat was refueling, so did we and we headed to the restaurant for lunch. I mean, it tasted as well as it looked like. Then we move on to the next location which was Hong Island where we had our canoe activity and it was so good. The rock formation, the terrain, the water, everything was so beautiful. I was in awe of mother nature. Next up on the list was Ice Cream Cave at Panak Island. It was filled with limestone and was really pretty. But our guide said that there was an anaconda somewhere, so we followed him and instantly regretted it. Nice. Demon. What are you giving? <laughs> oh, you got it, you got it. We didn't get to visit Naka Island because of unfavorable water conditions over there, and then we headed back home. After a super quick shower and dinner, we were off to watch Muay Thai fights.
it was fascinating to see all the rituals and traditions that were being followed and it was totally a different vibe from a UFC event. Finally, it was time to call it a day, but not for getting some street snacks. For the James Bond Island tour, it costed us 2,100 baht per person. And for the Muay Thai match, it was the ringside was 1,600 baht per person. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog and find it informative and fun. So that is it for today and I'll see you in my next one. Toodles!